Promoters of the Gel Blaster games are quick to point out that they're talking about having fun. Responsible fun. They're not guns, they're not weapons, they are blasters. They're a child's toy. And, you know, we're all grown up kids, really. The blasters are loaded with gel beads that have been soaked in water. They're approved for use by children over 10. While designed to be a toy, the blasters have had a bit of a bad rep. Two men were charged earlier this month for firing pellets at people in a Townsville park. Because some of the blasters look quite real, police say it can be confronting to have one pointed at you. We would ask that people that have possession of them use them in the appropriate manner and that's not out in public. Cairns Gel Blasters Club is working with police and Cairns Council to set up a dedicated space where there will be rules and supervision. They're assisting us into getting land where we can actually uh, set up a club area and a battlefield where all these people who have bought these blasters can come and play safely. We're up to 543 people, you know, and it's, it's just growing every day. While gel blasters have their critics, fans say they're a great low-cost way for families to get outside and have fun. A lot of kids these days are playing Xbox and Call of Duty and stuff like that, sitting on the couch doing nothing. What we want to do is get them outside, get them active, but not only just the kids, we want mums and dads. Sophie Lester, Win News.